I'm when I'm doing one thing, I end up by the time I'm done with it, I've thought of probably a hundred different things that I could add to it or do next time or that I want to do. And it, I know now that what I with this trade, I'll never carve everything I ever wanted to carve. I'll die before I carve everything I've thought of. I've got ideas that I've thought of when I, my first year, and I still haven't found the time to do them. Me and my son, we have a shop together on Highway 99. We both have ADHD. We kind of hyper-focus into our work. We kind of get in, we can become part of the work, you know, as we're doing it. We just become involved in it, and everything around us is just kind of blanked out. A lot of other carvers, they do just, there are certain little things that they do. They low carve certain little types of bear, and they all look the same, or they all look whatever. And with me, I can't stand carving something the same twice. It's like, it's boring. It just bores me. You're not using your brain. You're, you're just, you know, you've shut it off. You're using what you already know. It's like, I tried to teach my kid, you know, a, a laborer just uses hands, work all day, and he's happy as long as he gets paid. A craftsman, he uses tools and uses brain, and you know, and work all day and as long as he gets paid. The artist uses the tools, his hands, his brain, and his heart, you know, you put your heart into it, and that's where it all comes out, you know. And without your putting your heart into your work, you're just another craftsman. <laughs>